signing of her non and uh, because Edu is not available for the next match, he is, he is suspended. And because uh, Faris has got a slight injury, uh, can we see Hanan playing straight away? Is he, is he fit to start straight away? Well, we have things to, to decide still because we have today still the game. Fares had a problem in one training session, of course, but let's see today how he is going to, to recover. Edu is, uh, is suspended. Uh, for this game and I'm happy that Hernani is with us, that he is absolutely fit, that he is absolutely ready to, to, to help the team. As he said before, he knows perfectly the style we play, he's a player who is comfortable with the ball, he can play in different positions, he's a leader, he has experience, so I think he's ready to play and to help the team. Let's see if from the starting out he can help us uh, during the game. Let's see. Coach, uh, the last two days has seen very favourable results for FC Goa. Yeah. Chennai in, uh, and Odisha uh, drew the game, so they dropped points. Uh. Kerala lost to East Bengal, so they also dropped points. Uh. Does, does it give you confidence that maybe FC Goa can now push for a top four spot? Uh, is, is that on your mind? We are confident because uh, we are performing good. This is because we are confident. And we realise, we notice that now every game is a battle for everyone. It's not easy to get even one point for, for anyone. Uh, all the teams are playing for something. Uh, Chennai has options to qualify for playoff. East Bengal want to finish good the, uh, the season. Yanshepur the same, North is the same. So now every game is going to be very important and very tough. So the most important is uh, for us now the game on Monday, we need to, uh, to do a, a good game. We go there to try to get three points. It's a, a, a direct opponent for us, so the game of Monday is very important. And when you win, uh, all the results can be favorable for you. But the most important is that you get points, you win your games, and then we will see in which position we can, find, uh, we can finish. Odisha is just uh, one point from the three outings in the last three matches. So how you look at the uh, Monday's game? Uh, that is a very important game for them, that they are going to be under pressure because they have been in playoff during all the season. Now they are struggling with the results, but at home they are a very strong team. So uh, I think it's going to be a, a tough game for, for both. Uh, as, as I said before, uh, now every game is very difficult and I'm not thinking, I'm not paying attention on the past, on the last three games because on Monday is going to be a different story for both teams. When the referee whistle, it won't, it won't care what happened the last game, Chennai Odisha, it won't care that we came uh, after winning East Bengal and Kerala. So, the day is on Monday, we need to be focused uh, on that game and it's going to be very important for us. Coach, uh, except for Mumbai and Hyderabad, uh, most of the teams have struggled to win games away. Uh, uh, FC Goa won their first two games away against East Bengal and Chennai and since then haven't won. Uh, uh, why, why is it happening that FC Goa uh, you know, have found it difficult to win games away? If you ask me, I don't have a, an answer, a clear answer. No? Because, as you said, we started, we started the season winning two games away. We were very consistent. Uh, and during all the season, we have been very consistent at home. Of course, I feel the players play with more confidence when we are at home. Uh, but I don't have a, an answer. And honestly, uh, I think that we are able to, to win away also. We are going to Odisha with this mentality. So. Uh, don't think in, in the past, don't think in about the last result we had away in the past and trying to get three points. We play with the same mentality, with the same identity at home and away. That's true that for most of the teams uh, uh, are struggling away because it's difficult, but we are going to Odisha with the same mentality and trying to get three points. Coach, uh, a follow-up to that question. Uh, Odisha FC, meanwhile, at home, They've uh, beaten every other team apart from Mumbai City. So Mumbai City is the only team that has gone away there and beaten them. So do you think day after tomorrow uh, that will 
uh, you know, be an additional challenge for you? Yeah, it's going to be a, a big challenge because we know they are very strong at home. But it's important, it's very important for us and we have to face the game with the same mentality that we have at home. We don't have to, uh, to think if we are playing away or if they are playing at home, no? So it's going to be tough. We are going there to try to punish them with our threats, trying to punish their weaknesses. And let's see, I think it's going to be an amazing game, a game under pressure, a game that everyone wants to play. And it's going to be a, an amazing game, an exciting game. What are your thoughts on Odisha FC's uh, playing style and all that, given they also have a Spanish coach who likes to follow a style similar to that of yours here in Goa? Yeah, they, there is a team that, that try to play from the back, that they have very quality players with the ball. Uh, uh, I think in the up front, Diego Mauricio is performing really, really good. But as all the teams, they, they have also their problems, no? They, it seems at the starting of the season that they will qualify very easy. They were one of the sensation of the, of the season. And now they are struggling because it's difficult, it's difficult, apart from Hyderabad and uh, and Mumbai that they are uh, performing very consistently during all the season. For the rest of the team, it's a challenge every every game. No, so a lot of respect uh, with Odisha, a lot of respect, respect. Sorry, knowing that they are a, a very tough team, and let's see what happens. Coach, apart from Hernan and uh, uh, Lenny, we have brought another new signing uh, in January in. Uh, uh, not in January, just this month uh, in Nikhil Prabhu from Odisha. Have you been able to take a look at him in training, etc., and will he be available for selection tomorrow? Yeah, very happy also with the signing of Nikhil because with the injury of Mar, we, we had some problems in that, in that part of the, of the team. Also, you know the situation of Angwar for the next season, so it's time to, to do some things in, in that part for the, for the team, for the club. No? Uh, Nikhil is, is fit, like Hernan, so we have two more players in this area to, to, to use. And as I say with Hernan, let's see what happens after tomorrow. Let's see who, uh, what I decide. Uh, but he's fit, he's ready to, to help. All right, coach. Any more questions? Uh, coach, as I said, uh, just reiterating on the home and away. So Goa, are, uh, Goa has the second best home record and the eighth best record away from home. Uh, going into the final stretch of the season, uh, is making the playoffs uh, the only thing that you're looking at or going into the home stretch, getting into the third and the fourth places, how important will that be uh, in terms of making a difference once we get into the playoffs? Our only objective right now is Monday against Odisha. I'm not thinking uh, further. Monday is the, the main objective. We need to get three points in Odisha, and after Odisha, we will think in Mumbai. I'm not thinking too much now. I'm concerned, I'm focused on Monday because I think it's the, the most important game of the, of the season. Uh, on that, uh, basically, you go into the last four games of the season, of the league stage, right? And right now, the mentality is everybody is to win. Uh, and, not, and the focus is not as much, uh, do you feel that the focus will not be as much as to how we play rather than to eke out the points and does that make it easier for you because everybody is on the same page, they have the same motivation, especially in the last stages of the season? Uh, now every point you get is very important. Uh, playing good is easier to, to win games and to get points. So we are focused in our performance, in the way we play, because we know that when we perform good, normally, usually, we win or get points. So focus on have a good performance on Monday, uh, conscient of the importance of the game, and trying to get a victory there. Thanks, Coach. Any more questions? Well, I guess that's it. Uh, thanks, Coach. Thanks.